Curtis Jones truly was the greatest basketball player ever to come out of Detroit. A court magician who starred at Northwestern High School and St. Cecilia's Gym in the 1960s and 70s. He had all the talent in the world, but tragically he fell through the cracks. Curtis Jones was allowed to graduate from high school, even though he couldn't read or write his own name. That led to his downfall, a lifetime of drugs and mental hospitals and wasted potential. Curtis Jones never worked a day in his life. He died at the age of 50. This is the story of Curtis Jones. The best there ever was. The best there never was. Just a phenomenal player. He was like a, uh, for, for young players that want to know what it was like, I mean, the stuff that Magic Johnson did as a player, Curtis Jones was the, was the first player to do it, but not that kind of size, but he, he had the skill set to do all of those things. He was just incredible. Curtis was before his time. You know, he was not six feet. Uh, he's real thin, maybe 150, 60 pounds at best. But he was a magician with the basketball. He was like, Kurt Jones could take the ball on the full run from an inbounds play. Three dribbles and go dunking on the other end. That's the legend of Kurt Jones. Of the players that I watched play, guys I actually watched play, Curtis Jones had more basketball talent than anybody I ever saw play. 